So many of you ask if I have an OnlyFans channel. So today I will reveal everything, what type of channel I'm managing. Since I'm doing live stream every day and I receive so many messages from my viewers, from my subscribers and from my supporters. And also in Facebook, I receive many messages and even in Patreon that OnlyFans channels is good for me. <music> Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. By the way, I'm a Filipino vlogger from the Philippines. And if you are new here, please don't forget to click the thumbs up, click the subscribe, and click the notification bell for more videos update. So today, I will reveal everything. And I will also elaborate to you everyone and share to you what kind of channel that I am managing. But before we continue, happy happy 74,000 everyone. So our goal is almost unlocked wow almost i know that there is still 12 days left before or 13 days left before my um one year celebration so before the one year celebration our goal is to reach 100,000. so hopefully we can get that through our hard works and, and your support every day so the first channel that i'm managing the first channel that i where i am growing so youtube where i first being um known to people first being what is that like recognized to people and they, this is one of my main income so i earn a lot not a lot of money but i earn money on youtube um money that money that is like um can support my needs can support my dream for my future dreams and also can support my family so some will be asking me what if I will meet my husband in the future or my future husband? So what if he will say that you need to stop your YouTube channel if you love me? Or he will say that um, YouTube channel or me? So if he want me to choose, um, before he meet me, he need, uh, before we start the relationship, he need to be a... He need to be aware about the things that will gonna happen since I'm a blogger. So I will not choose either um, one of them. I will choose both of them <laughs> because YouTube is where um, I've known to people, and also YouTube is where I started making money, and also YouTube is the one um, fulfilling my dream for my parents, especially doing house renovations and um makes me feel uh, it makes me earn money that i will never earn if i work as a nurse aide so this is one of my step stepping stone to reach my goal in the future so i will not choose one of them so i will choose both if ever if that will gonna happen i will explain to him why i will continue youtube until i get older and i can also get uh, give this channel to my future or to the next generation the thing that i am doing live stream every day is like to reach the goal before my um one year celebration so during one year celebration i'm planning to what is that to cook a lechon <laughs> the lechon pork or we or lechon pig you call that a roast roast pig so that is one of my goal and dream during my one year celebration if I will reach 100,000 subscribers. So it is hard for me now to do live stream like three to five hours or almost six hours in a day. And I will challenge myself to make it every day just to reach the subscriptions that I need every day. And since we have goal, we don't need to say that I'm tired i'm not allowed to say that i'm tired i'm not allowed for that it's because if you have goal you need to sacrifice yourself sacrifice your happiness sacrifice your feelings in order to fulfill your dream fulfill your goal in the future so if you wonder why i'm doing live stream very long hours because that is depends also the viewers that that i've got and also the subscribers that i receive i have subscribers goals every day so i need to um i need to reach that subscriptions or subscribers before i end the live and i 
need to be more disciplined of myself i need to be especially the time and also my tiredness i need to set aside that one in order for me to reach the goals that i really wanted to reach in the soon <laughs> so what is my reaction when somebody told me or said that i need to like when somebody said that take off your clothes take off your tops uh, or take or like i need to be naked on the camera during live stream so during january or december many of my fans are saying that one and actually there are new fans they're not the old or few subscribers so during december guys i really really don't like it since that was the first that was the first month that i really started a long live stream and it really feels me so bad like why people are saying those things i don't it's because wearing a sexy clothes on the in front of the camera and also in person is really normal for me so i'm doing also that in the camera especially during live stream and people are saying like take off your clothes or something like that so i usually remove those comments because um, it really affects my emotions i was so super super down that time because people are thinking about that for me but no wonder because i'm doing a spicy questions or spicy topics and during january uh, like i really bash a lot from many people from also um like yeah many people especially one of my um supporters some of my one of my supporters also literally um bash me so much it's because of those kinds of things and i need to be naked they said that oh you're not a good vlogger you ch you change a lot i literally i feel those kind of things like i'm super like i really feel the pain inside like i really hate myself why i need to do this just to reach my goal but at that moment i watched many i after that january i watched many videos from other vloggers about their experience on youtube so i've learned a lot of things and the things that i learned is never never ever bring your emotions on social media because if you bring your emotions you can really affect yourself a lot and you can also literally affect some people and it can bring a negative vibes to your channel and to the entire viewers if you're doing live stream and also in your videos i know that i have so many bashers on my videos but now since i've learned a lot of things that i don't need to bring my emotions i don't care anymore so yesterday i experienced a massive bash and also massive um negative feedback from the viewers but i never cry i never cried yesterday if maybe that was july from december to january maybe i cried in front of the camera in front of live stream i don't know how many times i cried during live stream i just end up the lights live stream right away because um like i feel so sad that people don't believe me anymore but now i realize everything that life is so beautiful if you love yourself first before others and also always thinking about always do the direction that we you are good at the direction that makes you um have a good life in the future so i'm not literally like um very practical at all but i want to be i want to be successful that is the thing that i want so whatever hap whatever you do people always have have something to say even you're doing good even you're doing charity to people people i said people said that oh my god she's doing charity because to earn views and if you're doing a spicy topic they will say that she's doing spicy topic because she want to she want to get clicks and she want to earn more money so it's everything is balanced everything is tied so whatever you go people have always something to say so if you are happy on that kind of thing then go ahead so that is what i've learned so since i'm happy doing this kind of things then why would i follow people saying so since i'm happy doing this and i think that i am i i think that i will meet success in the end of the road then why not <laughs> why not so i will continue what i'm doing i will not listen to people who also don't have anything in their life people who don't have something in their table so since 
I am product I, I can feel that I'm productive on this way then I will follow the way that I started so next is why I do shower <laughs> during live stream so many of you why she's doing shower during live stream why she cannot do that in private so usually in the morning I get uh, I wake up in the morning and my first thing I need to do is to since sometimes I wake up super late so I used to get my phone and start the live stream I don't have wash on my face yet so all I have to do is to start the live stream after that so I'm sharing live stream on I am sharing my life on the live stream like my daily lives what is happening in my morning routine something like that so like shower shower is one of my morning routines so that's why I'm doing that also in live stream so at least I'm not naked on the camera you know so I'm still wearing my clothes and show you also how does I do shower shower and how do I clean myself but it's not like i'm not naked so there's nothing to worry about that because i'm not naked and also like i think uh, wearing my clothes is better than wearing swimsuits you know because swimsuit is almost naked but i'm just wearing my clothes like my workout clothes so there's nothing wrong about that and even my parents don't really care about that because they knows me and yeah they knows who i am rather than people who are judging me that they are just a new viewer and they don't know about the real life or the real who I am in person. There are so many like relig very religious on camera, very um, like very respectful in camera, but in real life they're not. So we're just, you know, I'm just showing who I am and my parents knows who I am, how I really am in person, who, I'm, who I really am in the real life so they trust me what i'm doing so before i had to pose why i had to post videos every day so long like something like november december and january i really posted videos every day because i want to i really want to move forward so fast and i only get like 1000 views 2000 or something like that so that is the reason why I had to post video every day. But since now, we are getting more than that. I'm not posting videos every day because some of you are asking, why, July, you change? Like, why you are not posting videos every day? Why you post videos every another day? And since um, I... I think I already posted so many videos and all my ideas. I'm running out of ideas, so I'm not posting every day. So as of the moment, I will be focusing on the goal that I need to reach before my or yeah before the one year celebration or one year anniversary of my channel so i will be happy to reach that goal then after that i don't know what will gonna happen maybe i will do live stream but every other day or still every day but short one unlike before that i unlike now that i'm always doing live stream every day three to four hours to five hours just to reach the goal subscriber goals every day next is why i need to be successful <laughs> this is the big questions that i have to be focused on so why i need to be successful in this way so based on my experience when i was a kid everything i have today is is it was just a dream like to eat in jalebi to live in the city that was my dream because i live in the mountain where I only eat banana three times a day. I eat banana three times a day with my family. Or sometimes we just drink coffee for breakfast on sometimes dinner without nothing. Only just water and the coffee. So it's super poor. It's super hard the life that I had before. I don't like to go back those times. And I want my parents experience the good life. Because I know that my mother experienced... I, she literally... Um, what is that like give everything that she can do for the family to stay in the family even it's hard just for us to have a good life but i know that she wasn't able to give that that to us the good life like in material way but for love she really literally give us give that to us like the love that we deserve but in material things and also especially the food the luxury she never i she can't afford to give that to us and i really understand that and i don't like to blame my parents why 
I had a very poverty life because I understand from the first generation, second generation, third generation, and to my mom's generation, how life was hard, was so hard. So I don't like to blame my parents because um, if it's not because of my experience or my life experience when I was a kid, I'm not like a fighter today. So I really literally um, honor or proud to my parents because if I never experienced hardship of my life when I was a kid, I will never like this today. So I'm still thankful to my parents that they raised me in a good way. They raised me with a manners and also like love to, yeah, manners and love. It's because if I don't have those things, I will never look back what happened from the future. And also I will never look back to help my parents today. It's not my obligation to help my mom, but it's in my heart to help her. I want her to experience the luxurious things in the future that she deserved, that she really want to experience when she was a kid. So I will give her everything without any saying that this is a credit from you, um, from you giving birth of me from the child until I grow up. So next is why my parents don't care about spicy topics that I made. Actually, they don't have YouTube channel and my sister knows about those things and they know me in person. They know me who I am and they know also that everything is entertainment. Just also some people saying that, oh my God, your video is so fine. It, mil it makes me also happy, feel me happy that people sees it as a like you know a comedy or something like entertainment so i really love also to hear that and since this is an, and since the videos are entertainment there is no effect on me whatever people are saying to me and also my family don't care about those because one thing that they really know is they knows who i am in real life <laughs> at least i'm not naked <laughs> At least I'm not doing naked on the camera. <laughs> At least I'm not very, very wild in real life. <laughs> so at least I'm not, I don't have different men every day, you know? So yeah, I already, I already shared to you about my first channel that I am managing. So the second is my travel channel so i have my travel channel and since the channel is very expensive why i told you it's very ex why i shared to you guys that it is very expensive because traveling is not that cheap you need to pay for your plane tickets ferry or bus and everything food accommodation so for me it is very expensive but since we are not rich yet i will not do that I will not continue that but maybe in the future I will also still posting videos there that is also people want to or likes to watch but if you want to buy that channel that channel is for sale <laughs> oh my god <laughs> all right so I'm not decided that yet but that channel is 1000 plus subs as of now so I will not touch that channel yet I will post videos later on <laughs> when i'm ready to post there when i'm rich because during traveling is so expensive and only only one video you can make for one trip <laughs> i'm not they're really good on explaining the surroundings explaining the traveling i'm not really good on that so i will try my best to post in there to post even one video in a month <laughs> my third channels are my social media accounts like facebook um, Instagram and Patreon so my Facebook is I have many pages on Facebook so I have two main page which is the July and the Masha so Masha's channel I just made that channel yesterday and hopefully you will follow the channel everyone so the link is attached on my YouTube um, YouTube link so just click my about on my YouTube and just visit Masha's channel and don't forget to click the like and also follow that is the main thing and so don't forget also to watch the videos of Masha's because I will gonna post more and more videos of Masha's um, growing growing <laughs> growing life wow so hopefully I will be with Masha's not be forever but for a very long time because I have a I have a cat in my mom's house and she is now 14 years old and this Masha is two months and a while ago she was being naughty and I do like that to her <laughs> just 
to give her a lesson because she was always moving the camera every time i'm doing this she always um disturbing me so it's not really good if i will not discipline but she's, she's now sleeping <laughs> she's now behave so yeah it's better to discipline my chef so this is one of my best friend here that sometimes being naughty sometimes um biting me and wakes me up early in the morning even at 3 a.m in the morning <laughs> and by the way i have a tiktok tiktok also but i'm not um usually update i i just post tiktok when i like the music i like the what is that the dub dub smashing and also like just just nothing my tiktok is nothing and i also have a patreon channel so i just made that two days ago and hopefully you will follow my patreon so i started doing advice there now about relationship travels and everything about philippines i will I am willing to help you since you're paying and it's only $10 everyone you can join my patreon and on YouTube I also have membership channel it can get really really give you a big benefits in terms of if you comment my videos or on my live stream it's easy for me to recognize because your name will be green and you have the star uh, or budge next to your name so I will prioritize members because they are the one who pay um, who pay much I hope they're the one paying and just to be part of their family so yeah it's only 2.99 you can join so those are all my social media accounts and the channels that i am managing so in short i don't have only fans i will not do that because since i told you everyone youtube helps me a lot in my entire life and for my family i will not feed my family with a naked or i will not feed my family in a dirty ways so in short i don't have a only friends channel and i'm happy to share that to everybody i know that i have many viewers every day many new subscribers and you are all welcome in my channel and in my life so thank you so much for the trust and i know that i have many indians and many people like um saying like spicy to me so as of i for now i really don't care about those things anymore since everything for me is normal every day like i you know if you heard those things every day it's kind of you really don't care anymore i don't like to um bring my emotions on youtube and that is the thing that i am really proud for <laughs> and by the way so if you're looking for a single filipina a christian one so i highly recommend you the christian filipina and i put the link in the description below don't forget to visit and yeah that's all everybody and thank you so much for all your support again happy happy 74,000 so road to 100,000 yay I'm so happy to get there to get that finish line well not finish line to get that success um line oh my god I'm so excited to eat lechon <laughs> I'm just kidding all right so thank you so much again and have a good day bye love you